Hey everyone, welcome to FS Hackers. My name is Afshan and in this video, we are going to deploy a LAMP stack application to Amazon Light Sale. So in this tutorial, we will deploy a LAMP that is Linux, Apache, MySQL and PHP stack application onto a single Light Sale instance. So without further ado, let's start. So I have already logged into my AWS account. And just click on this light sale service and click on this create instance you are creating this instance in virginia so i can change that i can use the mumbai i'm in india and it is a close region so i will use that click on this change availability zone and i'm happy with this ap south 1a that is zone a and uh, pick your instance image i will use linux okay and uh, select a blueprint will go with the lamp here we have the lamp that is linux apache mysql and php we'll use this and here we have to add a launch script okay you can add a shell script that will run on your instance the first time it launches so click on it and you have to copy the script from here so basically what we are doing is so we are going to this directory like that is ht docs and we are removing this completely okay with the help of rm hyphen rf we are removing this directory and uh, we are installing we are cloning this uh, to do php from github we are setting the writing permission here on the setting file that is connect values.php and we are injecting the database password into configuration file this is the command and we are also creating the database so i have already copied it so copy it paste it here change the ssh key i am using this default key like i have already created this wordpress key so i am using it you can create the new key from here just click on it and click click on create and you can write the name okay enable automatic snapshot i don't want that we'll go with the 10 usd because it has 2 gb and 1 cpu lamp php1 i'm happy with this name like you can change the name the light sale resources must have unique name okay server lamp server create an instance so it will take maybe two to three minutes to be in a running state so let's wait now it's in a running state so and click on this quick ssh connect icon an error occurred and we were unable to connect or stay connected to your instance if this instance has just started up try again in a minute or two so yes we have just started the instance so let's wait for two to three minutes so let's click on it again okay now we have connected let's write ls cat bitnami credentials so this is our password copy the public ip continue to cite so let's see enter the name of your instance and choose create instance we have done that we have already created the instance uh, you can access the running application to ensure everything is running properly it will take two to three minutes for your instance to start up we have seen that okay 
make note of your instance IP address. In your web browser, navigate to instance IP address. You should see the application running. So yes, we are seeing the application is running, right? To do list. So let's add some task to upload a video. Upload the video on 28th October 2022. Priority is normal, low, high. Okay. It is a very great app actually. Date, time and month is also there. Due date is 31st of October. Add task. So it's incomplete. Priority normal. Click on this list task so it is a very simple program written in php i really like it db host name is localhost db username is root and here is the db password okay great well but it is not secure it is directly showing the db password but it is for the demo purpose so obviously list task now you can attach the static ip address click on it and go to the networking and here you can create the static ip address that uh, you know uh, if this particular instance is stopped okay if you just stop this instance and if you start it again so the ip address will be changed so we don't if you don't want that so you would you just have to go to the networking tab and create a static ip address for your web application so i have already created the static ip address in my last video in my last tutorial that is launch a wordpress website on amazon light sale so you can watch that video now let's delete the instance click on this delete tab and delete instance yes delete you have no instances right now great so we have successfully deployed a lamp stack application to amazon light sale so that's it for this video guys i hope you like this video if you did then please share this video with your friends and your colleagues who are learning about aws and make sure that you guys are subscribing to my youtube channel we'll see you in my next video till then take care and keep learning Bye bye